Hello everyone, this is the Seeker of Grace. So I went to the world of Power Wash Simulator recently, and I might have embarrassed myself by falling asleep while washing a van, but then I realized that this world has a more relaxing atmosphere, and I found that the best way to work is to proceed at a slow pace while distracting myself with other activities. And what better distraction is there than to talk to all of you? Today, I want to talk about the Christian festivals Good Friday and Easter Sunday. And, as I do so, let's start washing this van, shall we? Perhaps I should begin with a little context. I find the Christian religion very interesting. The stories of the Christian Bible speak of grace and hope in abundance. As a tarnished, these are concepts I'm familiar with and can relate to. But the Christian religion also goes above and beyond these lofty ideals by introducing the concept of love. All these concepts are most notably seen in the biblical story of the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ events which Christians celebrate on Good Friday and Easter Sunday respectively. I once heard this short story from a Christian who was trying to explain the significance of Jesus Christ's death and resurrection. This is how it goes. God has a great plan for mankind, but this plan is ruined when mankind is corrupted by sin. As God is intolerant of sin, Man is separated from God and set apart to be condemned. But because of God's love for mankind, God the Father sent God the Son, that is, Jesus Christ, to be the ultimate sacrifice for mankind, shouldering all of man's sin on the cross. Then Jesus Christ conquers death when he is resurrected on the third day. And so, with the grace of atonement for sin and the hope of resurrection, man can now be reconciled to God through Jesus Christ, and can look forward to eternal life spent with God. Personally, I love this story very much. For us tarnished, our grace is no more than a literal guiding light for our journey and our hope is in the promise of becoming a glorified pawn of the greater will at the end of our journey. I dare say the story of the Christian Bible is so much better. Unlike the greater will's puny blessing, the gift Christians receive through grace is truly good, and their hope is certain. So, how do you feel about the message of Good Friday and Easter Sunday? Hopefully, it lifts your spirits or gives you peace. At last, the van has been washed clean. Well then, ladies and gentlemen, it has been a privilege talking to you. Thank you for listening, and grace be with you.